hair. It's Pat from uh, where am I from? US or New Jersey. And I can't consistently land my hair flips. Uh, Alright, position. I have to keep my foot around like where the grip is like chipping. So, so like see right here, the grip is chipping, so I put my foot like right in the middle. See from the board it's like messed up on the back, I chip it. So I put my foot over the chip, pop it, and then I make this kind of motion. I try and hit it with my heel because it is called a heel flip. Alright, so let me do a couple heel flips and then I'll send you that here. Hey man, so thanks a lot for sending in your video. I really, really do appreciate it. Cool. It's always interesting to me when your board looks so big. It's like your feet are standing right below your shoulders and it only covers like half of your board. That just blows me away. Um, that heel flip you landed was amazing, by the way. So is that. I love your heel flips because I'll tell you the reason why. Because your flick is so fast and the board is spinning really fast and that's really, really good. Watch your front foot. Boom. I was sick. So on that one, just a little bit under rotated. You were nearly there. You nearly had it. Just landed primo. Now let's check this one out. Cool. I love how far you're bending down and then you're coming up, popping with your back foot and just flick super hard front foot. Boom. That one was just, that was perfect. That was stomped. You couldn't have stomped that one any better. Cool. So your foot position is working, by the way. I'm not going to change that at all this is my foot position and i'm very specific about it can't heel flip for the life of me without this foot position so i put my back foot right in that back pocket right in that little pocket right there and then my front foot is up there near the front bolts and then i pop it and i flick and i do this your flick is great you are flicking great i really like to see your foot it comes up and then your heel just pop and then the board spins and it's and it's awesome so your thing is more of a consistency thing because you can do the trick it's just getting the consistency down so that's more what you're going to be working on and that's more what i'm going to be talking about in terms of your heel flip skate support is just a point of consistency now what i do to get consistent and this has really worked very very well for me so I have a certain set of tricks that I do every time I go skate. And if I land one of those sketchy, I do it over and 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 over again. But the main thing here is that you want to do it every single time you skate. And you want to skate as often as you can. Um, the thing about skateboarding is it's not one of those sports that you can like, yeah, I'm going to skateboard once a month and really learn much. You could if you're a really fast learner and you had somebody really good teaching you how to do it. Like I taught Lance all of the basic tricks in about three days. But yeah, Lance is a fast learner and I also really made sure he never skipped any steps. He had all of the tricks down building up and then yeah he was able to go from Ollie front side 180, back side 180, pop show, front show, heel flip, kick flip and he learned all of those three days flat but if you don't have somebody teaching you and you have these videos you have me you have skateboarding made simple you do have a lot of resources to use but in terms of just once you learn the tricks getting them more consistent it is just a point of practice repetition and both of those things are going to build up for you what is called muscle memory all professional athletes know about muscle memory. They know that the number of times they repeat a certain activity, they will get better and better and better and better at it until they don't really have to think about it. They don't pay any attention at all. Their feet just know what to do. You say heel flip, the feet heel flip. And that's built by repetition. So honestly, you just need to practice a ton and do as many heel flips as you can, as many times in a row as you can, and you will get it down.